All right, two, three months. So mm -hmm. she's been adjusted before. Mm -hmm. I'm still gonna explain what I'm doing. Yes, Everyone's got a little different yes. style, a little yeah. different way. It's gonna roll your body toward me. Okay. At the very end, little push. All right. And hear some noise and feel it move. Good, and just soft and relax, and right there. What is going on everyone? Welcome back to the Crack Addicts YouTube channel home to chiropractic media. Now in today's video, we've got another big chiropractic adjustment video featuring lots of chiropractors, all your favorite ones. All of the links to the chiropractors will have links in the description to their channel. If you wanna check them out, that's where you can do that. Or if you wanna contact them for treatment, that's the way to go. Now for the upload schedule on this channel, I'm gonna be posting videos every single day. So everyone's got fresh content every single day to watch. Now I'm gonna be posting the content at 8.15, that will be USA time. And for everyone who's in London, that will be around 1.15 p.m. But that's pretty, pretty much it for today's video, guys and girls. So if you do enjoy the video, subscribe to the channel, leave a like, leave a comment, and I'll see you on the next one. Next up, we have Dr. Scott Mitchell and Dr. Matt Delgado. From the body. So I'm gonna start with the one that I would think would be better. So we'll start with the left, and I'm gonna bring it straight out. And I want you to hold it here. I'm gonna bring it in, don't let me, okay? And then we're gonna do that same pressure over here, hold. Not even close. <laughs> feeling the rest of the spine from motion. Something just feeling straight away through here. And I mentioned to her off camera, there's a little, little bit of a flattening, we call it, to the mid back. We should have three distinct curves when we look at the spine from the side. A little flattened here, and that's where we really start to see mm -hmm. more pressure. And she's nodding her head, yes, because. She can feel it. Yeah. And you were doing rows, you said, recently, yes. right? And how, how do you feel after doing rows? Uh, the middle of my back was just screaming the entire time. On your side, facing me, okay. please. So we're gonna start with the low back. I'm gonna bend the top leg, and then we'll straighten the bottom one out. How long has it been since you've been adjusted here? About two or three months. All right, two or three months. So mm -hmm. she's been adjusted before. Mm -hmm. I'm still gonna explain what I'm doing. Yes, Everyone's got a little different yes. style, a little yeah. different way. It's gonna roll your body toward me. Okay. At the very end, little push. All right. Hear some noise and feel it move. Good, and just soft and relax, and right there. Good. Amazing, <laughs> oh my gosh. And then <laughs> face down for me, right. please. Now's your chance to redeem yourself, okay? okay. Everyone out there who's thinking she's weak. Okay. Well, let's have, start with the good one again. Right. Hold that out here. I'm gonna bring it in, don't let me. All right, good. I'm okay, nervous. here's your redemption <laughs> chance. Hold this one out here. Yes, oh yes, God. yes. I'm pushing harder and I can't get it. That's right, oh she's not. <laughs> That's crazy. Left one go up, or that right one works too. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. Teaching right. And then, and then that other one. Okay. Good. Does that feel different to you? It actually does feel a little that? better. Okay, good. Yeah, a little bit. And then when we even come down here, before I make that mm -hmm. correction, so the legs have evened out. And again, if you've been watching our videos before, you know that that's magic. Just kidding, it's not magic, it's mechanics! Yes. When there's a problem in the pelvis, it affects the leg length. So we're gonna move on to the mid back, and we're gonna be right there. I'll have you take a big breath in for me, please, and let it all go. Wow. Good. And then on your back for me, please. You know, trusting, yeah. I'm going to say, which is awesome. I like it. Usually you feel from the I first adjustment. I know how adjustment. It's good it is. I know how it, <laughs> what's coming relaxed. on the other this side. This is good, yeah. Mm -hmm. So with the neck, that's the one that you've been feeling for a mm -hmm. while. Let's give you some relief. Very top bone on the right. Good, and just soften your head. Oh. There, good. <laughs> wow. Okay. Left foot, was that? 
The one that was bothering you? Uh, it was, was the right this one. What is it? Okay. It was previously injured, so. And I actually asked her off camera because whenever I find a problem in the low back, I always ask about the feet because they're so related. Anytime we see a problem in the low back, it's really common to have a problem in the foot. So we're gonna check her foot for the same principles as any other joint, we're looking for motion. So when you know normal mechanics of the feet, abnormal mechanics stick out. That's called dorsiflexion. So when you're squatting, mm -hmm. that's the first thing that needs to happen. Right. In your ankle, you're not getting as much movement here. Okay. So we're gonna make a correction to that. It's called the talus. You can feel a little movement here. Good. There's usually no noise with the talus. Sorry, you crack addicts out there. <laughs> this one, we might start to get some noise. So here also, a little tenderness. Yes. Yeah. So there, same thing, no noise, but good movement. Felt it. <laughs> yeah. And then that was the heel. So same thing, her whole rear foot. So wow. I'm guessing at some point you probably sprained this ankle. Maybe you Maybe. didn't even realize it. That a lot probably, of times we don't. Yeah. Just like, oh, I kind of rolled my ankle, stepping off a curb. Yeah. No problem, because even the arch mm -hmm. there, a little tender. Yes, a little bit. And then if I follow that up, the muscles go into there and Ooh, there. Yeah, tender. she doesn't like that. Get her get her face <laughs> on this. Let's, let's torture her a little bit. Okay, that's what well, I'm going to torture oh, wow. you. So that's the posterior tibialis. Yeah. It's attaching down here. Mm -hmm. There's a problem down here. There's yeah. a problem in both spots. So this one, I'm not gonna lie, can be a tad bit uncomfortable, but quick. Okay. okay. Right there. There. And then one right next to it. That's the navicular. Okay. Good. Form. And then you had a metatarsal injury, you said? Was it yes, on this side? on this side, okay. yeah. Okay, good, I'm happy there. Yeah, this is crazy how <laughs> this feels right now. Yeah, and it's wow. hard to relay that to people at home maybe mm -hmm. because, again, you'll think of chiropractic all about noise, and we made no noise mm -hmm. here. Noise doesn't matter, although it's cool. <laughs> Just want to change mechanics, which changes signals from your brain to your body. So feeling again that glide there, and then how that moves, and how the heel moves. All three of those together, the heel's off, so we're going to make a correction here. There. Ooh, that was a big one. Big movement. <laughs> oh. <laughs> kind of makes a clunking noise. And then yeah. here also. So this, we might get some noise, people. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we did natural motion of your foot, yeah. which when that motion is faulty, pain in random spots mm -hmm. or symptoms will tend to show up. So here is the, actually that metatarsal right yeah. there. Uh -huh. Were you stepped on? Uh, no, it was just overuse. Okay. So it's a poor choice of shoe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it's dropped down. I'm gonna get an instrument okay. to make the correction. This is just a spring-loaded instrument. It almost feels like nothing. Okay. It just sends an impulse mm -hmm. strong enough to get some movement in that joint. So that's dropped down, and we're just bringing that up there. That's all I want. Good. Okay. And we're going to leave it at that. Let's have. Up next, we have Dr. Doug Willen. That's on the load. Hey. Right. Nice. So now I'm going to have you lie on your back, please. You can the most shredded shape of anyone. But he's just like the most mentally tough guy. Mm. Do you ever wonder? Do you ever wonder what? Uh, an adjustment for a guy like him would be for you? He, he would probably, have like a field day maybe. Yeah, he probably would love it because he says he's banged up. He just works anyway. Like it's not like he doesn't get sore. Oh, of course not. Because he talks about it. He goes, I'm trash, but I'll still run today. Yeah. <laughs> one time he was talking about how he had this one 
issue where he, he just kept on running and he never really like rolled out and it was like causing him to not even be able to walk. Yeah. He talks a lot about self-care. I think he works hours a day on working out the kinks. So he trains, but then he also like will work on a foam roller or whatever he needs to to stretch something to prevent new injuries, you know? Do you would we recommend foam rolling uh, daily? If yeah, you run especially, daily? Yeah, it would really help. Okay, I'm going to adjust this now. You ready? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> How are those? Wowzers. Good. Move closer to me. So, uh, move even closer. So let me answer that question better, okay? Because you're back here. You hear that crack in? Yeah, yeah, you crushed. Yeah, so that was good. Lie on your side facing me this way, please. So what I did is I just took your collarbone and your scapula and um, put my hand underneath and you grab your humerus and did a little move on it. Now I'm gonna do this. Got it. Come to the other side. Line your side this way. Pull this top knee up. Drop your head. Let this arms roll back a little bit. Pull this towards me, it's already popping. Good, line your back. Scoot this way one more time. Okay. And I'm gonna double up your arms like this. Right, good. And roll back this way. Good. Now let's look at those feet. I'm going to do one and then the other. Ah, that was it. There it goes. All right, sir, come stand up. If you made it to the end of the video, guys and girls, Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more.